Welcome back to the channel, I'm Jay Malone, and today I'm going to tell you how to screen record on iOS 11. If you're new to the channel and you would like to learn more about photography, drones, technology, and other related things, then please consider hitting the subscribe button. When you do, tap the little bell icon next to it, that way you don't miss anything. I have a few different videos on here of different apps that I use on my phone, and for those videos I often do a screen recording or a screen capture of my iPhone. And when I do that, I often get the question, how did you record your screen? So today I'm going to tell you an easy way to do it. In times past, it required plugging your phone up to a computer with a QuickTime player and doing a screen recording that way, saving it to your computer. But you had to have a computer to plug your iPhone into, unless you were using some jailbroken app or something. But uh, I didn't do that. I used my computer, and that's how I done the screen recording. But iOS 11 was just released yesterday, and with that is the capabilities of doing an iPhone screen recording without a computer. And I'm going to show you how to set that up now. Although this is built in, it's not real easy to find. And in fact, if you just go to settings and you search for something like screen record, uh, you won't find anything about it. So let me show you how to get to it. You want to go to Control Center. When you get into Control Center, tap on Customize Controls. Once you're there, you can customize your Control Center uh, with a lot of different stuff. But if you'll go down and you will find screen recording, tap the little plus icon right beside it, and all of a sudden, if you go back up, your screen recording is there in your control center. You can actually tap here and move it around if you want it uh, kind of at the top there. Once you have it the way you want to, get out of that, you can close your settings. All you have to do now is swipe up from the bottom, and right here you have the record button. Now do a long press, so hold it down, and you'll see here it gives you the option to turn microphone audio on or off. Microphone, there we go, the audio is off or now the audio is on. So once you determine whether you want audio on or off, start your screen recording. Oh, there we go, start recording. I'm new to this, guys. So there we have our countdown. It is recording now. We can get out of that. You'll see the red bar is up there. That means we are screen recording. So. Yeah, that's all it is to doing the screen recording. It's pretty simple. When you're finished, you just tap that, tell it to stop, and now the screen recording is saved to your photos. And once we're in camera roll, you can see here, countdown, it is recording now. We can get out of that. You'll see the red bar is up there. That's it. That's all you have to do to screen record. That's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, or if it was helpful, please hit that thumbs up. I would greatly appreciate it. And leave me a comment down below. Let me know what uses you have for this screen recording. What do you plan to screen record? If you wanna see some more of my videos, click over here. And if for some reason you're not already subscribed to this channel, click on my face in the little circle icon right below this video. That'll get you subscribed. Thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And until next time, God bless.